Matter of fact, before we go in, yeah, he a prophet sent back to the earth, back to the earth. He said you watch this video, do me a solid. Hit the subscribe button below and the notification bell. So where was the Bible at when we was like this? Right, that's a good question. You're right. It was actually used as a weapon to weaponize. We, we were taught slaves obey your masters. You understand the same book was used and taught to us the wrong way by the wrong people because the book was never for them right. in the first place. They couldn't teach it to us the right way. It's not their book. It's not theirs. They got your history book and they trying to teach it to you. They don't understand our book. You understand? Read what you got. Revelation chapter 13 verse 10. Come on. He that leadeth into captivity. What does the Bible say? He that leadeth into captivity. What book are we reading? The Holy Bible. Listen, pay close attention. Who, who put us right there on the bottom of them ships? Right. Did he lead us there? Read. He that leadeth into captivity shall go. Shall what? Shall go. Shall what? Shall go. Shall go where? Shall go into captivity. The Bible says that the same people that took us into captivity are going into captivity. That's They're right. going into slavery. Yes, the, the same Bible, the same one we've been reading, the same one you say is a white man's book, say that he is going into slavery. That's prophecy. That's facts. That's going to happen. Is that just? Let me ask you that. Is that fair? Should the white man go into slavery for all the atrocities that he's done right. to God's chosen people? Right. I'm asking you. Me yes. No. no, he shouldn't. No. All right, so you say that he should just be forgiven for this, right? No, I mean, no. That's what you're saying? No, no, no. Yes, you are. No. Read it again. Verse 6. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. Oh, we just read no. Revelation chapter 13, verse 10. He that leads into captivity shall go into captivity. That's in the same book. And then you tell me, right, that, nah, I don't think that should happen to the white no, man. He should be forgiven for all of this even, stuff. Even the Bible says the eye for eye makes the work. You he, can't, he, you don't, he should be forgiven for all of this stuff, yeah. right? So let me ask you this. Bible Hold on, let me ask you this. Is the white man still benefiting from this slavery? Yeah. He is today. And he should just continue to benefit from it. But I don't think that what what, what was what <laughs> you confused, what was, bro? No, what you say no. He shouldn't benefit from the slavery, but he shouldn't go into captivity. He white, shouldn't be punished. Should Nothing be should be done you to said, him. You said the same right? come upon again. You right. said what the fuck happened just right here? So right. why would you want that to happen again to any man, regardless of what they've done in the past? Read Revelation chapter you thirteen. You don't forget. You don't forget. You can forget. God is a just forget. God of just balance. But you, but you don't right? forget. You, right. you can forgive, but not forget. No, no, no. But to say that that should happen again to anybody? Read what you got. Wow. Man. Read what you got, read what you got. Revelation no chapter way. 13. That, I'm, I'm going to take it even further for you. This might just mess your whole mind up. All right? What we do to them is going to be twice as bad as what they did to us. Right. All right? Just so you understand. I just wanted to seep in. All right? So the things that we do to them, it's going to be twice as bad. It's going to be double. So if this right here, what you see, imagining that done to your neighborhood white man, or imagine that done to any group of people, and that messes up your spirit, just imagine that done times two. And we can't even put on poster boards the atrocities that they did to us, alligator bait and all of that. You can't even you can't even split, picture that. Split two men in half. Split exactly. Why in the hell would you, you want understand? That to any man? You can't you regardless can't. Of your, regardless of your religion, listen. why would you want that to happen to any man? Was it right when they did it? Because God was said it, do it. Was it That's right? why we wanted to happen. Right you understand? Uh, God uh, said do it. it right? That's why we wanted was to it happen. Right? Right? All right. Was it right when they did it to us? God said was to it do right? it. Was it right? Was it right? So God tell you to harm other people. Listen, listen. God, God tell you to harm other people, right? Let me ask you a question. God tell you to harm other people. Yes or no? God tell you to harm other people. All right, hold Revelation 13. Hold on, God. Hold on. Get to the army chapter 28 and verse 48. It's going to determine a lot. Listen. You say God tell you to harm other people. Listen good. Listen good. God tell you to harm other people. Listen good. Right? Yes or no? I'm going to answer your question. No, that's all I want to know. Yes or no? Hold on. We should ask your question again. God, you saying that God is telling you to do unto do that to them times 10. Right now? We gonna keep the peace until Christ come back, and He gonna set the whole world in order. That's, that's what we gonna do. Christ. All I'm right, you. I'm you telling you. You feel like we should do this to other, other men again? Listen, I'm telling you. Christ you said that that's the Most High God in Christ said that this is gonna happen times two. Okay, times I'm, two. I'm you feel I'm, right hold, hold, doing hold, that to somebody hold, else? Hold, hold, you feel right doing this right here times two? In Revelation chapter 18. You feel that, right? And I think it's verse four that's that I want. You feel. You feel like. All right. You feel like that's okay. That's right. Listen, I'm gonna read the Bible. Read the Bible. 
I'm talking too much. Let me read the Bible. Read what you got. Revelation chapter 18, verse 4. Come on. And I heard another voice from heaven say, Come out of her, my people, that ye be not partakers of her sins, and that ye receive not of her plagues. Come on. For her sins have reached unto heaven, Rick. and God hath to remember her iniquities. Rick. Reward her even. What does the Bible say? Reward her even. What does the Bible say? Reward her even. So when Christ comes back, right, what's going to happen, right, to our enemies, is they're going to get what? Yeah. Come on. Reward her even as she rewarded you. And double. And what? And double unto her double according to her works. Uh, these are the works of the so-called white man. Yeah. The things that you see on these signs, those are the works of the so-called white man today. Right? The so-called white man. No. Not twisting the twist. Not twisting the scripture. You know, that, that, that's, that's not true. twisting the scripture. The Bible says that this Christ nation. Back, hold on. The Bible says. Back, hold on. We're going to do things decently and normal. I'm going to talk to you. I'm going to ask you a question. I'm going to give you a chance to speak. Listen, listen. I'm going to give you a chance to speak. All right? No. I'm going to give you a chance to speak. This ain't Christianity. Say it again. That's not what? Thank you. We've been enslaved by Christianity. This is Christianity right here. Right. White man Jesus. This ain't what we teaching. Right. This ain't what we preaching. Right? What, what? We're not teaching that. Thank That's you. Right. So you never heard the doctrine of the Israelites. You That's never right. heard the doctrine of this Bible. Right. You ain't heard it before. Right. You don't sit right with your stand, right. right. The Bible says reward her You're double. Right. You know, so really what's right. going to be rewarded say that, say is that double. Anybody is going to be harmed by the most high or anybody that is overall is just pure bullshit. I don't even want to talk no more about it. Because right. if you sit right here saying, listen, listen. if you are okay and smiling, listen. smiling because that's what happened to people, then you fucked Hold up that. Ass, Hold on. I'm going to keep reading stuff like this what you. Believe in. He ain't going to chapter 9 and verse 10. You should want to put Hold on. I'm going to keep bringing it out for you, all right? Peace and freedom. And, Hold on. Hold on. Just listen to the Bible. Listen to the Bible. No more. No more. If that's what that Bible, if this right here times two is what that Bible's telling you, teaching you. To all the people that did this, all right? Times two. Who you got? Hebrews chapter nine verse ten. Hold on, it ain't just for it ain't just for our enemies. God's people gonna get put to death too. Read what you got. All the sinners. All I'm, the what? All the sinners. All those that break God's laws. All those that 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 that, that continue to defile yep. themselves. You understand? Yep. All those that won't repent and get themselves right. Yep. All those that won't practice to make perfect. Come on. All the sinners of my people shall what? Shall die. Shall what? Shall die Come on. by the sword. By the what? By the sword. Come on. Which say the evil shall not overtake. No. They say, hold on, that thing you read out the Bible, that's too much for me. That evil not gonna overtake me, you understand? Read. That the evil shall not overtake nor prevent us. Come on. And that day. That's it. Sir. That's it. So listen. If you say this evil ain't gonna happen, it's not gonna come to pass, you're gonna be destroyed. All right? I'm saying. All right? You are whether you believe it or whether you don't you believe are, it, it's gonna happen. It don't matter. It don't, whether you believe it or whether you don't believe it, it's going to happen. How are you gonna come out here and preach and talk to people and give people the Deuteronomy people chapter 28, verse 40. Wait, wait, what they're saying to you, you're not even listening. You're saying, no, bro, you're wrong. I'm listening. So what I'm saying is, is if. You are okay with your Christ, your God, your Savior, whoever the hell you want to call it. If you're okay with them going through this again, times two, if, if you think when that- When who going through this? When did the white anybody, man go through this? When I'm did saying, the white man go through this? If you are okay with them going through it, okay. that's not okay. Two wrongs don't make a right, and they never have and never will. But what I'm saying is, is if you think, it, matter of fact, not even if you think, if that's what they're preaching, and that's what they're telling you is going to happen, and you love that, and you're okay with that, then bro, you don't come to the Listen, listen, listen. We need to come together as all people. Yes, don't, don't forget. You're saying a lot. All right. But don't forget. But you already said that you want them to go through two times. Watch this. Day? Are they still benefiting from this? You, we already, we already answered. Yes, right? We already answered. Yes, right? Answered yes, right? Yes. What's going to change that? Us. How? We, we do. What do you mean how? How are you going to change we it? We do the opposite. We, we come How? Up. How do we overcome this? How long have we been out of slavery? 200 years? No. How long have we, yeah, America? okay, in America. How long have we been out of slavery in America? But it was about 200 about 20 years. years. About 20 years. What have we done to change that? It's only been 200 years. Only 20 years? Only a long time. Years. No, it's not. Right. Yes, it is. No, bro. Right. That's what, a, hold on, hold on. That's a second. As a, compared to time in general and the, the creation of this earth, two, 20 years. What have we done years? in the last 50 years? 200 years. What have we done in the last, the last 50, 50 years? Year, discrimination. I mean, uh, segregation was just abolished 50 years ago. In the last 50 years, segregation yeah, 50 years was abolished? I said about 75 years ago. 
no more than 100. It was like what, like 19 in the 19. In the last 50 years, segregation was abolished. In the 1940s, 1950s, yeah. Segregation, segregation. in segregation. the 1940s, the 1950s. Segregation, as far as people coming together, that, that was abolished. Look it up. All right. So since then, we've had what? In the 1600s, we've had. We're taking steps listen, down as people. Listen. Like, Listen, the things that, what, what are we going to take steps towards? Doing what? Like, what types of things? Doing what? What can we do to, because, listen, watch this. In the 1920s, right? Have you ever heard of Black Wall Street? Yeah. All right. Yeah. There was businesses, yeah. establishments. Yeah. So, what happened to that? They all got burned down. The By who? White men. <laughs> all right. So, we just supposed to be okay with that? Yeah. So, when we build and we do the things that you're talking about, what's the trend? Okay, but you saying Hold on. I'm asking you a question. When we build and we do those things that you want us to do, What's the trend? What do you mean? What happens when we build and establish things for our own? Because that was during the time of Jim Crow. There was segregation, right? And we were separate. You're I won't right. even say we were, it was segregated. We were separate, completely separate yeah, from you. Right, right. All right? Yeah. Doing our own thing. Yeah. Even still, what happened? They destroyed it. They destroyed it. Yeah. So we were trying to do the things you said would help our community. Yeah. And even still, separate from everybody else, somebody else came in to do what? To destroy it, yeah. right? That continues to happen. Yeah, that's why you make sure it doesn't happen again. How, how, what power do we have to do that? What do you mean? What yeah. power do we have to, to, to build another? Uh, did, did that happen again after the 1920s? Did we build any other establishments like that? It's been a hundred years. Yeah, we, uh, we have hell of a, we have hell of establishments now. What? Where? Everywhere. Everywhere what, what, you uh, look. In Portsmouth, where can there, I go? There, there ain't no black-owned business. In Portsmouth, right where can I go? There ain't no black-owned business. Name ten of them for me. I mean, I, uh, Chef Skips. Uh, let's see. Um, there's a nail salon right down the street from my house. A black man owns an, um, the, the freaking smoke shop next to my house. Uh, let's see. I just got a black man's realtor card. Selling houses. Let me see the card. There you go. So, uh, a, a, a black man. Creed Realty is not all, it's all about white women. I, I, Creed I, Realty is all about white women. Is, is, all right? There, a black so, man this is a black man. man. That Something works for a white woman, just like you got a black man working for the the A Rab in there. You understand? Yeah. <laughs> it's to say it's this this isn't what you see right here isn't a, a black I, business. I said, I said a black man. They, it's not if a black a business. Man, there you go. <laughs> it's not a well, black man, business. If you're, bro. If, you're a realtor, right? if you're a realtor, then I, you you are under not a black a business. business. It's not a black okay. business, all okay. right. Okay. You understand what I'm saying, okay. right? Okay. He's a contractor. He's he 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 work. He's an employee. He's a he's a he's a 1099 employee. He don't own that business. Okay. Right. A he white woman own that business, all right. Okay. So my point is, okay. you can't okay. name you got ten one. establishments around here what owned by a black man. I just moved right. the Bible. I just moved the Bible. I moved the Bible. I moved the Bible. What you got? Deuteronomy 28 and verse 48. So really Read you guys. Deuteronomy not, chapter you know, 28, verse 48. Hold on, bro. You good. Therefore, shalt thou serve thine enemies. The Bible says, listen, bro. bro the you Bible said, says you that. You said there wasn't 10 black owned business supports. That's fucking stupid. No, there, there may be. Hold on. Let me answer That's your question. You come, back, come back, come back, come back. Listen, listen, listen. Listen, I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you a question. Good, good, bro. Good, there there good, are more bro. than ten bro. black owned business in Portland. Everything, everything I said Listen, you, you, there you, are more. You down. I'm speaking to you. Everything I said to you. There are more than ten everything. black businesses in Portland. I, I agree with everything. you. Everything. There now, are now, many. There, here, listen, you, there bro. are more. I'm gonna say it again. There are more than ten black businesses in Portland. I know that. I agree with you. I know that. You you asking? Hold on. My point. This is my point. Listen. Listen. This is. Listen. What do you mean? Get Zephaniah chapter 2. Listen, this is my point. My point is, there may be more than 10 black businesses here in Portsmouth, yeah. but it's hard for us to name 10 black businesses I in Portsmouth. I just moved four months ago. Let of course it's hard. All right. Of course. Listen, listen, listen. I bet that you can... Come close, come close. Listen, come close, come close. This is my point. I bet that you can... You just moved here four months ago, but I bet you can name 10 white businesses in Portsmouth. You can do that. No. All you gotta do is think of ten businesses. More likely, they're gonna be owned by white people. No. You understand? And let, and let's these these are facts. Like, oh, you know, no. Yes, Frank Creep. All these these are franchises. You yeah. understand? And like I said, we just got the power to be who we want to be and be. No. Listen, fifty years ago, you gotta give us. No, time. no, no. Remember time. what we said in 1921? What happened? We built from the ground yeah. up. So it's been over fifty years. It's been over that. All right. That was a hundred years ago, and that was about less than fifty years out of slavery. So we've gotten way more power we should have if your doctrine, if your beliefs is true. But they're not. That's that's what I'm trying to explain to you. Like you have to use logic with some of the things that you're saying. Every time yeah. we build, Everything. things are destroyed. Yeah. The only way we're gonna build is if we do this. Read what you got. 
Zephaniah chapter 2, verse 1. Come on. Gather yourselves together. We agree with, we need to come yeah. together. We need to get, yeah. we need black businesses. Yeah. We need more black businesses in Portsmouth. Yeah. We need these things, you understand? Come on. Gather yourselves together. Yay. Gather together a nation not desired. Who's the most undesirable people on this earth? The people you see on that sign right there. No question. We're, we're, we're the most undesirable people. We're hated everywhere we go. We're in the ghettos everywhere we go. We're even killing each other more than the other people are killing us today. Who got more black on black crime, crime than we do? The thing about it, it doesn't matter. Who got more abortion that clinics than we do? That doesn't matter. Who got more Planned Parenthood than we do? You understand? Yeah, we have the choices. We have choices. Right, now. and we're continuing to make the wrong choice. What? We're continuing to make the wrong decisions. Says who? All right? Says who? Says the reality. Look around us. You understand? Who live in that ghetto right there? They selling drugs in. Black and white people. No, mostly who though? Black and white yeah, mostly who though? Don't matter mostly who. Yes, black it matters, bro. No, it don't. Yes, it, it matters, bro. Black you and say, white people. You say you it. Saying black, black and white people live in those projects. Does this matter right here? These were mostly who on this shit? Black people. Right. Does that matter? Yeah. All right. So who live in that neighborhood all right there? Black people. Listen, who lives in that neighborhood right there? Who, who lives? Who, black and white people. Who is the captain of that shit? A white man. Right, who's the captain of that neighborhood? Not the fucking trashy white people living in there. Who's the captain of that neighborhood? I don't know who owns that. Who built it? I don't know. You don't Did the black man? Did the black man? Do you know? Man, do I you can, know? I, I, I can guarantee you that the developer of that complex was not your so-called black man, all right? It was not your so-called black man. It was not your so-called black man. I can guarantee you that, all right? All right? I can guarantee you that the owner of this store right here is not your so-called black man. It's a same way I can guarantee you that, all right? No, listen, we need- A white man has to build that because you can't watch that. If you see anything good, we need white man. We need businesses. We need businesses, but it has to be according to the Bible. Like you, you got to be a white man. Deuteronomy chapter 28 verse no, 28. No, no, no. Zephaniah chapter 2. Yes, All right? Because we do need to come together. Hey, you, you got black on right here. Zephaniah chapter 2 verse 1. On. Gather yourselves together. Yay. Gather together, O nation not desired. Now, my point was, we're the most undesirable people on this earth. Whether you want to believe that or not, you understand? All you got to do is turn the news on. All so right? Who? Listen. Who though? The most desirable people to who? To every other people around us. So what the fuck does that matter? <laughs> it makes a difference because we're oppressed, robbed, raped, and used yeah, by every other people around us. Right. right? That's why it matters. We used to scream black power while heroin was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission Minor murmuring, omitting and missing the mark Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark We on Paul's mission We out on the road Purple and gold From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana Sierra Leone 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling These are our men repented at heart the scriptures is proof, IUIC, we deliver the truth.